Hello and welcome back to the channel. If you have been using Python pandas library, you might be used to seeing dot group by and dot mean functions work without issues when combined. Also the dot core function to find correlation between data columns used to execute without issues. However, when you run similar commands now, you will likely end up with lengthy type error indicating that the string could not be converted to numeric values for calculations. The output you saw shows error when trying to run dot group by and dot mean functions with default parameters or basically without the default parameter values being overwritten. But if you set parameter numeric only to true and run the command, it will not throw the error. We see a similar outcome to this next command that is trying to grab a row of data using dot loc command with index number. It gives error with default parameters. But again, if you set parameter numeric only equals to true and run the command, it will not throw the error. Now, what about the core function for correlation? Well, we see similar behavior to what we saw earlier. Although you will likely end up with value error rather than type error, the underlying justification is the same that the string could not be converted to numeric value for calculations. Again, if you set parameter numeric only equals true and run the same command, it will not throw the error anymore. So what changed? The cause of this can be explained when we see the documentation for the API. For example, when you run the command help df.core, it will give you some information about APIs that you are using. And if you scroll down, you will actually see version change information. This indicates that since version 2.0.0, the default value of numeric only is now false, meaning that by default, it is trying to do numerical calculation over columns that have non-numerical data. So when we set numerical only equals to true, the default value of false is now overwritten to be true, meaning that now the command will only consider columns that have integer, floats, or Boolean data types. It is always good practice to learn how to read official documentations. I will share this link in the description below, but if you look at the left, there is a list of all available APIs in the pandas data frame, including .core function, .groupby function, and .mean functions we saw earlier. If you are looking for a specific API but can't look at it, you can search using Ctrl F and type in the name of the function that you want to learn about. In my case, I'm searching .mean function and it will jump to the link for that API. However, for the purpose of this video, I will stick with the correlation function. If you look at the API documentation page, it will indicate the version number at the top right corner and also describe the inputs and outputs of the function. It also indicates that since version 2.0.0, the default value of numeric only is now false. And if you track back to previous versions, the default value of numeric only was true. This is consistent with what we saw earlier with the help command. Therefore, from the official documentation, it becomes easier to track major changes and the version from which the changes came into effect. Now let's look at the documentation of mean function. We see that major changes in this API also came in version 2.0.0. This indicates that since version 2.0, the default value of numeric only is now false in this case as well. If you scroll down to the bottom, there is an example that explicitly recommends that numeric only should be set to true to avoid getting an error. 